This is my encaustic class. And the students are doing different textures and techniques. One of them is casting with balloons. This is Michelle. She is in the process of dipping her balloon. Sometimes the balloons will break. The balloon is filled with water to give it volume so that it'll hold its shape when it gets over to the sink now. Now we have to go to the sink. To cool the balloon down. Empty the water out. And there it is. A perfect orb. I don't know about perfect, but it'll work. So she lets it sit there for it to dry. And then she's building up a large scale sculpture using these orbs. I should say that two classes ago we had this technique used very successfully by Paula Zamet who did installation pieces with the orbs. So let's go again and show the dipping of the balloon. And it's coated with Vaseline too. Oh, I forgot, the Vaseline, say that again. Um, the balloon is coated with Vaseline so that you can let the water out and remove the balloon without breaking uh, your Or Very good, Vaseline comes in handy. <laughs> She's making me laugh. <laughs> what does Vaseline come in handy? <laughs> we have been doing encaustic for eight weeks and this class has really caught on with it so again we go over to the sink if I knew how to edit I'd do that but Working with encaustic is very sensual to it. Perfect. And let's take a final look at the, the sculpture. A number of balloon cast orbs that could also be filled with wax and lots of things can be done with them. Thank you very much.